guys, Prince of Macedon here. I'm gonna do a live commentary video for Rome Total War. It's a free-for-all. Squared resolution. So, one of my favorites. Uh, six players, 20,000 denarii. Not one of my favorites, but hey, it's still a free-for-all. Anyways, uh, Romans, Seleucids, and Scythians. I'm next to a Seleucid player and a uh, Scythian player, so I did not... Well, I brought a different army. One that can handle a lot of cav, and one that can maybe handle cattle fracks, maybe? Not really. It's raining here. It's cool though. Anyways, I'm watching, I'm re-watching uh, the HBO Rome series with my girlfriend, and she's liked it so far. We're two episodes in, and uh, she told me she likes it, so I'm excited because I love that show. Anyways, I don't know why we're still waiting here. Let's see who we're waiting for. Waiting for the Brutii guy, apparently. Alpsu, Alpsu, or Alpsu. Take up the sword, string your bow, look to Alright, this is kind of annoying. Armor. Now comes the hour when we test Roman courage! Alright, finally. So, we'll take a neutral stance, even though squid resolution, I don't know who I want to fight. Because if I fight Scythia, they could run. They might still fight, but they would have to run a lot to skirmish me. And I don't want that, because that would take a long time. So I might... Be opting to fight the Seleucids, but let, let's take a neutral stance here. Leave the peel on. Gotta get my uh, Triarii right here. I got one unit of Triarii in case I have to deal with Cataphracts. I mean, you're thinking one unit of Triarii? You know, what, what good is that gonna do? Well, I don't know, to be honest. Couldn't really afford any more urban zone. Very unusual I actually put my general with an armored general unit. I usually don't do that. Oh come on, I'll PSU. So I'm ready to go. Let's go see who we're waiting on. Probably all PSU again. Waiting on the host and Foyer Fry. Apparently PSU is ready to go. Armies here. Let's march on Seleucid, they're closest to me. So the Seleucid player is the host, Helvegan. Let's go look over here. Way over here we got the Julii player who is for some reason is camping out. I don't think he got the memo that this is a scored resolution battle. And I don't know where he's going, he's heading this way, but there's nothing this way. So close to closest to him, we have this guy, the Brutii player. That's uh, all PSU. He's facing towards the uh, SPQR Romans here of uh, Lawrence the Roman. Can't see his upgrades from this far. And then over here we have the the Scythian player. This is Salty. He is marching towards my rear. I'm gonna have to save him for later on. It would be nice if you went for the Julii player. Oh, he's switching directions. Yep, he's switching directions here. Good. I can fight this guy. I'm gonna use my Triari to help my my Cav fight those Cataphracts. They're gonna be a, a severe menace. Actually, it's Cataphracts with companions. So, how many are Cataphracts? This general is basically a Cataphract. Well, it is a Cataphract, sorry. The general's. Actually, sorry, his general is a companion. So how many Cataphracts does he have? He has four Cataphracts and two companions. God, I hope someone kills all PSU because this is taking forever. Just takes out his army and he leaves the game. Get it. Get it. 
let's send this unit up here to absorb these missiles from this guy. So I'm going to absorb some missiles here. It says he's firing, but not anymore. He's targeting up my calf. I appear to be wasting my missiles on. He is not in Phalanx. Oh my gosh. PSU, dude. He's still not in Phalanx formation. He better get in Phalanx formation. That's to be really bad if he doesn't. I'm gonna have a free unit here to hammer and enable this guy. Well, his cav's losing really bad, but my infantry's getting hammered right now by his cav. The hammer and enable strike right there. There you go. General is killed. Fear makes a home in our enemies' hearts. Don't let those those cataphracts get away. Those are expensive units. Host should be dead here in a second. General with fear. Now he flees the field like a coward. Legionaries are hurting me right now. Show their true virtue. They are not soldiers, only frightened rabbits running from our men. Oh, damn it. There you go, hit these pikemen from behind. Great, I got I lost like all my infantry. Bad game by me. I mean, yeah, by me. <sighs> Enemy army is in flight. Pursue them and drive them from the battlefield. So let's make sure we run these guys off the field. You guys get away here.
These are points, my friends. This unit appears to be glitched, so let's do it the manual manually. There we go. Knocks him down. Please get them. Oh my gosh, you're, you're like right in the middle of my guys. How can we not kill him? There's like one guy left. No, there's two guys left. One's over here. Where's the other one at? Okay, now where is this fight happening? Oh, uh, that, that's for the one guy. Okay, what's this? Can't do that anymore. Okay, let's go find troops to fight. Great gods be praised! The enemy general is killed! Fear makes a home in our enemy's hearts! Okay, let's let Scythia fight Julii. Because from what I'm hearing, it looks like these guys have no... Like they're really fresh. So let's... Let's get over here. I don't know how Sith is going to be able to fight this guy. Not with this setup here. Okay, now where is Lawrence's army? Okay, I got this unit right here. That's the general unit right there. Yeah. Let's send these guys to kill the general. That, that, those, that's a, those are points right there, my friends. Why would he put his general with his peasants? I don't know. But I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna snatch that. I so I sent my units with just one, three, and six over. Because if I send just one unit, it'd probably die. All right, Lawrence has left the game. Okay, let's let the one unit go last. That was weird, putting his general by himself. I mean, isolated in this corner with just peasants. It's bad enough to isolate your general like that. Well, I'm about to kill his general. And I think I get more points for that. Pick up the pace. Unless there's like hidden units over here, which I can't see. In which case, six, three, and one is not enough, but this should be enough to kill peasants. July just got some free kills against these archers, oh my gosh! But now the uh, Scythian Cav is coming back. These guys will murder Roman Cav, because they're all, these are all headhunty maidens coming. The oh, there goes the Julii is. General. Press forward, so the spirit of his army is Let's get back to my side. Too. We're about to kill this isolated peasant. What the heck were they thinking? I don't know. See, I, I've been watching my guys here since the beginning. I don't think I can make it over here in time. Alright, we're in combat over here against these peasants. And the general. I gotta kill that general. That's the whole reason for going for this peasant unit. Great, these guys actually might beat my guys. That'd be really sad. Says they're beating my guys. And I can cycle charge. I'm cycle charge these guys.
Getting a ton of experience killing them. That's good. Let's do another one. Let's use the, uh, the old charge bonus for this one. Put them in wedge. Which, I don't know if wedge can actually be formed with two horses. <laughs> Oh, nice! This should take him out. This charge coming up here. General is running away. This there we go. Way for a leader to behave, but in battle, it's I gotta kill that general before he leaves the field. He's right next to the the neutral zone here, or the uh, the red camp. Please kill him. This might be what gives me the edge over the other players. The Killing this general. general flees. Press forward so the spirit of his army is broken too. They get him. No, he's still alive. Attack! Oh, I got a maiden at the process. And the Scythian in general. Yes! Enemy general is killed. Totally worth it. Alright, let's go link up with my buddies over here. Enemy's hearts. That was totally worth it. Anyways, my idea, I had plenty of ideas for a free-for-all, which they tried to implement in Warhammer, but they didn't really get enough information, apparently, or didn't bother to research it. It was my idea to put the the kill count, or the, the score count, somewhere on the screen so people can see who was winning. Problem is, they put the armies right next to each other in free-for-all in Warhammer, so it's like, it's not, not really a free-for-all, it's just a big, real rumble with very little uh, maneuvering, but they're right next to each other, and the master is so small you can't really maneuver. They need a bigger map for the free-for-alls. And they need the two modes, score resolution and last man standing. Because people like scores and people like uh, last man standing. See how big this map is in Rome, in Rome 1, Medieval 2? They're huge! That's what made these free-for-alls awesome. And of course, obviously gameplay. These, this Roman captain can get destroyed by these maidens here. But those maidens, as I said, are armor piercing. Exactly what these Roman uh, Praetorians are wearing armor. You know, I can intercept these units as they come here with these these guys here. So that's a good placement after killing their general. So they should be tired by the time they get here, and when they do, I can just run them run them down. Get some more points. Oh, these guys are high value units too. Chosen Archer Warbands. I gotta kill these archers here. Get some points. Don't think he's gonna let me. Might not be worth chasing these guys anymore. Let's get through the archers. Alright, Scipioite in the house. He didn't see me coming. I need to get a good swipe on this guy. Alright, now he sees me. Great, I lost a cat unit. Oh well. Keep chasing, my friend.
He made a mistake. Nice. Thank you for the kill, Cynthia. I, I really do appreciate that. My turn to chase you. Oh man, this guy's giving me all kinds of kills. Maidens can't find urbans, that's different. Oh man, I think I'm guaranteed my victory here. Thank you. Did I bother kill that unit? Yeah. Oh, we just have archers here. Oh, you know what that means? Dead. for the kills, my friends. Whack. The gods be praised! The enemy's hearts are full of fear and now they flee! God, this is great. Man, Cynthia just gave me a freaking mill voucher here. Eat for free. Well, it wasn't too free, but it was fairly free. I guess it's kind of like eating at Ikea. It's, it's almost free. So let's see, should I fight this guy? Or should I have to retreat? I could just retreat. But I don't have enough to fight this guy. You know, I can always try, see what happens. But if he runs, then crap, it's starting to stutter. Alright. See you, my friend. Hey, don't eat that wire. Oh, wait a minute. Do I have some more units over here I can chase? Are they too far? I can try. I mean, they are taking the long way. Now, why do cats chew on wires? I don't understand that. Oh my god, they're taking the longest possible way off the field. guys left the game. I mean, that's pretty much what he is good for. Just, he just kind of sat there. 
His army's untouched. Except until he fights Cynthia. Guys. He has left to terminate the game. That's alright, I won. Then So let's go look at the armies really fast. represented here. And then the Scythians. Scythians. There you are. Oh, let's switch this to normal skill here. Sorry about that. Alright. So all the Romans were represented. Sidians and the Seleucids. Okay. Here's the army of Fortify. Here's the army of all PSU. Here's my army. Here's the army of the Senate. Lawrence and Roman. The Scythian army here. Look at that, a peasant general? What, what are you thinking? And then the Seleucid army of the host, Helvegan. Alright, good game. Hope you guys enjoyed the free-for-all. See you guys.